Our guest tonight was recently on King of the Nerds on TBS, and now she's here. Give it up for Rochelle Keeling. Rochelle! Yeah. Welcome. Welcome. Have a seat. Right there. Swiss works, right? Whatever you want to do. How are you? I'm doing great. How are you? Good. You're not nearly as nerdy as I thought you'd be. Is that, a, is that an insult? Are you growling? <laughs> I'm not sure the mic is picking it up, but she's definitely growling. <laughs> it's actually the predator noise. It's not working very well because I need water, but you know. Do you want some of my water? It has no. strep in it. And it smells weird. Not that our sponsor, Coffee Ethic, provides you with strep. Don't start that rumor. <laughs> To be fair, they didn't start it, you did. Right, I, I, you're right. Don't repeat that. <laughs> Don't do it. Um, so how'd you get on King of the Nerds? Tell us what King of the Nerds is for people who only watch Fox like you're supposed to. Right. <laughs> well, I mean, you only watch TBS for Big Bang Theory reruns and King of the Nerds, so definitely you know, yeah. tune in. Uh, King of the Nerds is a big reality competition for $100,000, which I did not win. Uh, and Spoiler. <gasps> I'm so sorry. It I was aired. DVRing it. Ah, you were never going to watch it, Jeff. No, you I was weren't never going, going to. to watch it. You weren't going to. All right, well. No, I watched stuff with you on it. Good. Yeah. Well, I was on every episode, so I know you're lying. I know, but you, <laughs> every episode? Uh, every episode. Okay, so yeah, I am lying. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, yeah. Even after you got booted, you still. I did. Actually, it was a glorious moment where I got to get booted, and as I was being booted, he was like, but. You don't have to leave. And so I was the only one that got to walk back into the house after being booted and watch my own Horcrux be placed. So, so that's kind of like um, dropping out of school and going to graduation. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly like that. So uh, on, the nerd, on the King of the Nerds, there's various competitions. Yes. And you have to compete to see who's the best at being a nerd. Well, no, I'm the best at being a nerd, but you have yeah. to compete on like who's the best at winning a hundred grand, and I wasn't the best at that. So. Right. What would you say is your um, biggest nerdy tell? What are you into? Oh. Uh, well, I'm into Harry Potter because I am wearing the Marauders map, just in case you don't know. Yeah. Also, I have Muggle socks because that informs you that I do not have special powers. So you uh, are indeed a Muggle. Um, and I'm representing Gryffindor, but. That's a thing I'm into. Uh, I was tagged as the gamer because I've been playing video games my entire life, yeah. you know, since I could hold the controller, which is at one month old. And um, other than that, I watch anime and I read manga. I'm popular for knowing to have said that I read anime, so. Sure. Yes. What do all those words mean? <laughs> anime is like a sophisticated cartoon. Sure, sure, yes. <laughs> and manga is like the sophisticated cartoon on paper, but you read it backwards. Okay. And Harry Potter is the wonderful world of witchcraft and wizardry. And um, everything else, you just, you really need to step up because it's, it's life. Right. What? What? <laughs> have you ever played a video game? I mean, it's a thing. It's a real thing. No, I have. Like, you can do everything you want. <laughs> everything. You're getting into philosophy here. Let's talk philosophy. <laughs> what, uh, but how did you get on King of the Nerds? Oh, You were oh. on there, but how did it come about? Uh, I was on a Sony PlayStation Network show called The Tester, uh, okay. which wasn't on TV. It was just on Sony PlayStation Network. So yeah. if you have a Sony system, you can watch it for free. Um, and I was on it for a day. <laughs> so I was the second one to go. Um, and I met a girl named Danielle, and she happened to be on season one of King of the Nerds. Okay. So I watched her, and then I was like, I could do that better. So I went on King of the Nerds, and then I got fifth instead of fourth, so I didn't do it better. But um, uh, anyways, I watched her. I auditioned for season two, and then I didn't get on, but I made it quite far. And then yeah. I auditioned for season three, and they told me that I might be on. And then they called me while I was in Florida vacationing with my boyfriend and his family, and they said, you're not on. And yeah. I started crying. And then and I got home, and the day before the final interview, they called at 7 p.m. at night and said, will you board a plane at 6 a.m. to L.A. and pack for a month, right now? The and night was, before? The night before. <laughs> and I was like, yeah, of course. Right. <laughs> so I forgot a lot of stuff, but I was there. Yeah. And um, we wanted to find out, because uh, you are, at least around here, you're the king of the nerds, I would say. Yeah, absolutely. Or queen. Yeah. Whichever. I mean, both. 
We wanted to see if you, king of the nerds. That's why he was separating the colors. There's a guy downstairs separating colors of nerds. Him. We have purple, pink, and green. Yes. So we're going to make you close your eyes. Oh my. And see if you can figure out which color you are eating. And okay. if I don't. Thank you for closing your eyes already, oh, by the way. I was ready. Okay. What were we going to say? I, I was just, I was ready to go. I was pumped. And if I don't get it, then it's not any more disappointing than the fact that I didn't win $100,000. Right. The stakes are equal. If you get this right, you will win $100,000. <gasps> if I get this right and he doesn't give, that, give me that money, you are all my witnesses, including wherever you out there on the TV that watch this. I was lying, just so, for legal reasons. <laughs> you will win our admiration. Okay, close okay. your eyes. Okay. I'm going to give you one of these. You have to decide. Are you mixing them up? Mm hmm. What is this flavor? I'm so scared. Oh, I got a couple. Just whenever. I'm tasting the savory flavor of green. Yeah, you got it! All right. Two Bring out of three, on. you have a chance at $100,000. That's why I changed it to a chance. I feel like I'm feeding a fish. That's gotta be purple. So good! You are the Empress of the Nerds. There she is. We will be right back with McKenna and Brock. Good job. He's my favorite.